for turbocharged van racing. I told you guys, they race everything in this country, including ambulances. The van is a massive part of automotive car culture here in Thailand because these vans are working vans. They're either delivery vehicles, people haulers, or legit ambulances. We're gonna take a walk around the paddock, check out some of these vans up close and personal, then we'll get back to the drag race. So one thing you'll notice is there's really two different types of vans here in Thailand. That's the Toyota Hyas and these, which is the Toyota Commuter. You can probably tell that the Toyota Commuter is a much larger van. You could fit like 15 people in these things. This is what people use to transport large groups of people around Thailand on road trips. The Toyota Hyas is its little brother, and personally, I love these things. I'm actually considering buying one. So when I come to these events, and I'm sweating my balls off because it is hot as crap in Thailand, I have a place to escape to with some AC and a computer set up in there so I can do video editing on the go. Look at the rear tires on this one. Hero drag. This thing has legitimate drag radials on the rear. Am I getting in? Am I going for a ride? Is this what's happening here? I guess we're gonna do some test hits here in the paddock. Bro, you think I oh my god, this thing is quick! Oh, I did not expect that. Wow, that was actually fast. Bro, what the what have you done to this thing? I did not expect that. That van is faster than most of your car. Here are a few of the ambulances that are going to be competing in the drag race today. And I love this one. It's rocking work wheels, a big brake kit, and a carbon fiber hood. You're probably confused on why this is even a thing. And the reality of the situation is ambulances in Thailand are not funded by the government like back home in the US. These are individual businesses. A Thai person buys a van, converts it into an ambulance, and they get paid per ride, per patient, they take to the hospital. And if you're unfortunate enough to go to a hospital in Thailand, you definitely want a modified van with a little extra horsepower getting you there as quickly as possible. Oh, by the way, I'm excited to announce that I am working with Omaze to give you guys the opportunity to win a brand new 2022 McLaren GT and also help support an amazing cause, the Make-A-Wish Foundation. Go to omaze.com slash cbmedia for your chance to win. Your donations support what I consider to be the best charity on planet Earth. The people that are responsible for giving kids with chronic serious illnesses amazing life-changing experience. There's also the whole McLaren thing. Click my link below for your chance to win a twin turbo V8 600 plus horsepower McLaren. This thing retailed for like a quarter million US dollars and that was before the prices of cars just totally skyrocketed. The color of this car is called Ember Orange, and it is, in my opinion, like the most perfect McLaren color spec. So yeah, for your chance to win your very own 2022 McLaren GT, go to omaze.com slash cbmedia. Remember, donations help support the amazing work of Make-A-Wish Foundation. Now, let's get back to this ambulance drag racing thing. So from the information I'm getting, this red Toyota Hyas is one of the fastest vans on the property today. I have no idea what it runs, but we need to keep an eye out for this one. See, this right here is what they call track prep. And I'm going to tell you now, it's not very effective. The track here at Bangkok Drag Avenue is very rarely maintained or properly prepped. It's equivalent to what we call no prep racing in the U.S. The track service is definitely not what you would call sticky. Okay, so get this. You see this orange plate back here? Do you know what that orange plate means? It means this is a school van. This van is used to transport kids to school during the weekday. And I guess now that it's Saturday, they're out here drag racing it. And look at this. In order to get more weight over the rear of the van and get better traction, 
they have a dude sitting here in the back of the van. They were legit no lift shifting that school van. This is amazing. This is so amazing. Dude, this thing is so incredibly clean. And if you look at the paint, that is not a wrap. That is actual paint. It's like this olive green with the white wheels. That van is crazy, crazy clean. I really dig this one. I dig the color combo of the red van with the bronze T37s with the blue calipers. And remember, from what I was told, this is one of the faster vans here at Bangkok Drag Avenue. Look at this. What up, dude? Let's bump. Boom. When that van launched, that kid's soul left his body. That scared the shit out of that kid. He's got work emotion wheels on the front, endless brakes on the rear. He's got inky RPF ones with a drag radio. <laughs> waiting to see this ambulance run all day. I am just unnecessarily excited about this. And I just noticed he has titanium exhaust as well. That thing is freaking sweet. the highest ambulance that one was really clean visually i'm a big fan of that one let's check out what this ambulance is going to do yeah, buddy. <laughs> this stuff makes me so incredibly happy I don't know why, just seeing ambulances do massive burnouts brings me huge levels of joy. This ambulance means serious business. Look at the front and rear wheel and tire combo. Yes, that is a Mickey Thompson on the rear of a turbocharged ambulance. Welcome to Thailand. six with a two three sixty foot have you ever seen an ambulance run a faster quarter mile than a 15 six i haven't personally i hope you enjoyed my video of this very unique form of motorsports here in bangkok thailand thank you for watching and i'll see you in next weekend's video peace